Eh? Nice house up there. You get freaking lost up there, man. It's walking up that hill. It's craziness. Crazy. Crazy. All right, folks. So, this is the setup I've been talking about, guys. This is what we do. Uh, let's do that. All right, so... This is how I run this. Uh, today we're gonna be cutting down some brush, some trees. Just today we're probably just taking down a couple trees here. Eventually this is all coming down. So maybe let's just take a look and we'll see what this looks like when it's all done. Be all cleared, I mean, all the way down to here, dude. All the way down to here, all this. All this, man. But. We're going to start with this little tree here, but I kind of want to just show you and tell you. So, when it comes to these pole saws, I like using these electric ones. Uh, you know, they're not very expensive. Here's one, getting getting ready to rock. Um, but yeah, inside, you know, my tough uh, box here, this is the large. I've had this on here for three years now. It's been awesome. It hasn't leaked. Nothing. I jackknifed into it a little bit here but I mean still keeps going I got electrical I should put some of that gorilla tape on it but it's just more like a little crack in certain spots but still going strong and this is my Milwaukee six bay charger so like I said man I don't need anything um, I barely rarely well I do just because I just I feel like doing it sometimes, but I don't have to ever charge these batteries outside my rig, so to speak. This sits in here, and when I need to use it, I still got two full batteries here. But like, like I said, I put six of them on here, and you're ready to rock. Um, yeah, so this is how we do it, and I'm going to show you. We're going to take it down a little tree with my power station on. All right, well, one should be ready to rock. Just like that. Nice. So, this is Juan's first time using this setup. Now, go from the other side. No, I need your truck then come back more from the back because. Oh, it's not long no. enough. All right, well, let's start. We were going to start in a different area, but um, I kind of wanted to get this on here for you. Um, yeah, take it off. This is portable too, and that's the greatest thing. I usually just like clicking it in here. Oh, this is even a better way we can show the portability of the DeWalt power station. Juan, mm -hmm. just take this off of here, bud. Mm -hmm. So, how's everybody doing? Very good. Juan's very, very good. <laughs> Bring this to on. where you need it to go. And like I said, this thing, I've really only changed the batteries once uh, in it. Um, one of these batteries is pretty low. I think these might be this one. These are pretty much charged up. But uh, yeah, man, it works for so long. I probably used charge that six bay charger six, seven, eight times. And I still have like two, three bars on some of these batteries. As you know, when you use this, this these start to die first. So, all right, so. Just like butter. All right. Try to get that one. See? Just take it right from that bottom part. See it? Yeah. Go right down. Don't and don't hit the ground or the dirt, because that's how the blades get dull. There we go. Alright. Just like that. Um we have a gas powered one. I don't really use it too much. It's just so easy to use this. I do have a cordless one by Greenworks, but awesome. Worked great. No, I, I, no, I don't. That's going to end up getting stuck in your hair. Just pull this. I'll pull it out. All right, we got to get to work here. Um, 
Yeah, I have a Greenworks. No, it wasn't Greenworks. Earthwise. Awesome pole saw, but it's like four years old now, and the battery is just about done. So, to get a replacement, they don't make batteries for it anymore. So, that's very important when you get into a line also, man, because, like I said, that Earthwise, it's a cordless 10-inch pole saw. I mean, this pole saw made me so much money, and... This battery just doesn't keep the charge. I get through maybe like five minutes and the battery starts to die, but they don't make replacements for it anymore. So that's the issue. But it's great having portable power, guys. And that's what this DeWalt power station is just awesome at doing. So that's about it. We're going to start clearing some of this stuff. Uh, but I hope everyone has a great day. We might come back later. But as for now, this is what uh, we got going on. And uh, that's about it. We'll check you later. One tree down. Two more to go.